escorting Lachelle is Drew and Jacob. Escorting Melinda with Joe. Greeted Isabella is father of the groom, Jay. Tune. We're going straight in to the first dance. Oh, I think I need to fix my hair. <laughs> what? Where's my beer? No beer? No beer? <laughs> dance with the bride and groom. When you cry, be sure to dry your eyes. It's better days for sure to come. But when you smile, be sure to smile wide. And don't let them know that they have won. When you walk, walk with pride Don't show the hurt inside Because the pain will soon be gone When you dream, dream big As big as the ocean do Cause when you dream it might come true When you dream, dream When you laugh, be sure to laugh out loud, cause it can put all your cares away. And when you see, see the beauty all around yourself, it will help you feel okay. When you pray, pray for strength, that you help you carry on, when the troubles come your way. When you dream, dream big As big as the ocean When you dream it might come true When you
So Devin's dad, Senior Hyde, would like to say something to y'all. Hello, everybody. Thanks for coming. I am Devin's dad. Y'all hear me? You're looking very like, what the hell is this? That's okay. You're doing okay. I like this guy the best. I hadn't really, I think I met him once before. There's just something about him that is easy going. Right? Reminds me of my son, Devin. Devin, the hardest time I ever had with Devin was when he was first born. And I think he had the colic is what you call it. And I can remember working graveyards at the railroad and coming home and walking Devin back and forth by the bassinet, back and forth and back and forth and back and forth so his mom could sleep and go to work the next morning because I needed the money she made. Anyway, Devin was a great kid. Uh, never had any problems with him. He's real gentle and just easy going. I've never seen him really get mad like holler or anything. And I'm so proud of him, you just don't know. <laughs> Yeah, we both. He see where he gets his little crying stuff from. <laughs> but uh, I've had some major disappointments with him over the years. We're improvising here. <laughs> uh, my wife got me into going into nursing school. I had a fine job. I was doing just good, and she bugged me so much that I started taking classes. They had night classes back in those days, and one day I was finished. And Devin had just started school. And he had already taken most of his prereqs and stuff, so I talked him into going into nursing school. And some of you may not know, and it may be a little different now, but it was pretty tough to get into nursing school. So one of my most favorite memories of his accomplishments was Devin actually got into nursing school. I still got the letter. One of my greatest disappointments in life, because he was only a year behind me, we could have worked together, <laughs> was Devin said, Dad, I don't want to be a nurse. So here we are. Devin is uh, self-employed. He's doing really well. And how much more proud could you be? Aww. I love you. All right, well, Devin and Cheryl arranged for us all to have great wood fire pizzas. Uh, wood eats pizza I think is the name but please guys go order your own pizza they'll make it for you they have gluten-free options so talk to them about what you want and they'll make you guys your own pizza or, you can start dancing. or and more likely start dancing with Cheryl all right y'all go get something to eat Darren, to come to the dance room. Uh, Emery has prepared a gift for you guys. So you guys are going to stand here and listen to Emery. So you guys. Take it away, Emery. Yeah. 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 Thank you. 